Garrett wanted to see what the drop spring looked like on the front. Yeah, go slow. It's still coming down. It's got to settle too. Well, they ain't got a shock on it right now. That's way too much wheel gap. What? That's way too much wheel gap. It does. If that tire is, that's a 30 inch tall tire. It ought to at least be able to touch the fender. It's definitely lower. Oh yeah, that's got like a country mile. <laughs> I mean, by the front end, you can tell. We really got to clean this shop. Don't shut that all the way. I can sort of tell. The back ends in here, though. Yeah. It'll also get a little bit lower once we do this side. Yeah, it's got to settle. I mean, that's definitely three inches less than the other side, yeah. but that's still three inches, not enough. Like that legit should drop three more inches. I mean, well, at least. The other side, the, those stock springs are retardedly stiff. Yeah, but it's still not going to be, once that settles, it'll probably go another inch lower. Yeah. But that, I think that's a three inch drop spring. I need to look and see what I bought. It might be a two inch drop. It might not be enough. Yeah, where's the box at? Did I keep the boxes? I think we threw the boxes out. That's tubes. I think we threw the boxes out. Is it? Some of these speakers. This wire. See what that's that one there. This one. Yeah, there'll be a part number. Flip the lid. Nope, there you go. It's on the back. Nine one zero zero six three four. Is there a? Nope, they're two inch. Two inch drop. Yep. Huh. Two inch drop. Front coil spring. We need the magical four. We're going to, have to go four six. So don't do anything more with these springs. I got to try to sell them, and they're still brand new. Yeah. I'm gonna order four six drop. First, I'm gonna ask and make sure I can do a four six drop on these without issues. But yeah, that's too. That's not enough. Stay tuned. We're going lower already. 